damage you've done to yourself is way beyond anything else that can happen to you from me or any other judge that would be sentencing you in this criminal case. You are now a permanently convicted felon. Your family who loves you and supports you, I only want to use the word forgive because forgiveness isn't even necessary. They're with you so much. They're so tight-knit. But you have to live with the fact that you really put them through a ringer. You've embarrassed your valuable friends in high places, the elected public officials, people in the media. You've embarrassed them. You have to live with that. I don't know if those relationships, relationships can be repaired. You've become toxic in your own workplace. Your career uh, future is uncertain at very best. It was really on a rocket ship uh, to success, and now you've, you've turned yourself into riches to rags, and it's so unfortunate. Your very name has become an adverb for lying, and I cannot imagine what could be worse than that. I'm trying to consider who you are as a person, how you got here, how somehow you strayed away from your family values, you let that dark, narcissistic, selfish, and arrogant side come out, and you persisted with it for years on this case, I'm fashioning the following sentence, and here's your sentence. I'm sentencing you to 30 months felony probation, and the probation is going to be to this court. You're going to be allowed to travel wherever you want. You do not have to live in the state of Illinois. You can report by phone. I know that uh, if you're going to try to make a living and do some of the things you do, you may have to go to uh, other uh, the places, New York and Los Angeles. You can do those things. You will pay restitution to the city of Chicago in the amount of $120,106. You are fined $25,000, which is the maximum fine.